Hello everybody, and welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be doing another randomized Spiral Abyss challenge, but this time with a little twist. We're going to be calling this one the Farina Random Spiral Abyss Challenge. Now, what is this challenge? Well, let's talk about it. And it's going to be a normal Spiral Abyss challenge where we go through stages 11 and 12, skipping 10 and 9 because they are ridiculously easy. So we're going to start out at floor 11 and have two random teams on each side. But the twist this time is that we're going to be able to use Farina to replace one unit on one side. And our goal is, of course, going to be to beat the Spiral Abyss with these two teams. So without further ado, let's get in to the video. Oh yeah, also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel. Only a small percentage of you are actually subscribed, and it really doesn't take that much time at all. All you gotta do, go down, click a little button, and bam, just like that, you're subscribed. Anyways, with all that being said, let's go and do another random abyss. All right, let's go. Random Spiral Abyss, Farina Edition. I wanted to try this for a little while because honestly, any excuse I have to use Farina, I'm going to take it. And I felt like this was the perfect video to use her in. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to start out by randomizing two teams for floor 11. So let's head over to the Random Abyss Generator. All right, here we are, the Genshin Impact Team Randomizer. Essentially what this does is all you have to do, click a little button here, boom, it generates two random teams for you. Pretty simple website, I'll link it down in the description if you wanna use this for yourself. But anyways, let's generate our two teams. All right, here we go. First half, we have Fremene, Toma, Lynette, Lisa. That's gonna suck. Second half, we have Mona, Heizo, Yaimiko, Ayaka. That's gonna be a lot stronger of a half. Unfortunately for me, my Toma and my Fremene are both level 20, so they won't be helping very much. Luckily, I do have a level 80 Lynette though, and a level 80 Lisa, so that will mean something. Now here is the interesting part though. We have two teams here. Now with these two teams, we get to substitute one of the characters with Farina. I think I'm gonna do the first half because this second half is pretty strong on on its own. So why don't we take out somebody from the first half here? I'm thinking probably Fremene or Toma as the two level 20s. It doesn't really matter too much, but I think I'm going to take out Fremene and then put in Farina. And there we go. We got our two teams. Let's build them up. So our second half team is already going to be pretty built up. Of course, we got the main DPS Mona build going on with the Nim stream and the Lost Prayer. Pretty OP build with a 10, 10, 10. Same thing with the Ayaka build. Pretty OP. We got Anami Nomenala Kaguchi with the four piece blizzard. Also on the 10, 10, 10. And then we got Yaimiko, who's at level 80, has an O Swarm's eye, and some pretty decent artifacts as well. Don't have that much investment into my Yaimiko, but it's going to be enough. The last character there was Heizo, who again is already built on a Mopa Mare. And a two-piece, two-piece. And that's the second half. Now, for the first half, a lot of those characters are actually unbuilt. Even though I have a level 80 Lisa, she has no artifact, she has no talents. Let's change that. For her artifacts, I think I'm just going to take all my Kaching pieces that have like crit rate, crit damage that are in the Thundering Fury set, because those are going to be really nice pieces. And there we go. We got her on the two-piece thundering, two-piece glad. We actually have constellation for Lisa as well, so that's pretty nice. As for her weapon, I think we're gonna use I think we're gonna use the R5 Widsith. That sounds good to me. This is gonna be a fun build. We're gonna have like semi DPS Lisa here with 37 over 250 crit rate crit damage. We might need to balance that out a little bit. Let's get this crit rate hat onto her instead. And now we have 55 to 209, 124 recharge, and 1.8k attack. Pretty decent. Next for Lynette, she is also unbuilt. We're gonna need to build her on something decent. So I think we get her on the obvious choice, which is Favonia Sword, just to generate a little bit more energy for our team. And then of course, we're also gonna want a four piece Verdescent on her if we're able to get it. Perfect. Constellation three, talents are 1810. And the stats are 67 over 111 with 242 recharge and a ton of attack. Next up, Farina. Her build isn't going to change. This is going to be the same build for floor 12 that we'll use as well with a four-piece golden troop. All pretty decent relics. Wrong game for her. Constellation 0 and talents are 177. And then last up was Toma. 
who is level 20, but you know what? He'll die in the first 20 seconds. I'm sorry, Toma. Level 20s don't live that long. Maybe you can make it past the first stage. We'll see. All right, here we go. It's time. You're in for a little shock. You're in for a little shock. Oh, God. These guys actually kind of do damage to me. To be honest, we might have to use, like, Farina DPS here, because I don't know how else to, like, break this these guys' shields, to be honest. Because Lisa ain't gonna do it. I mean, I guess we can use Lisa DPS. That's kind of fun. Who doesn't love Lisa DPS? Boom! Oh, I forgot Farina also takes HP for us. We might need to get a little bit of HP back using our little healing guy there. Uh, unfortunately, they are destroying the crystal, but, yeah, there's not much we can do about that. <laughs> Yeah, we've already lost a three-star. That's kind of unfortunate, but that doesn't matter. We're not going for the three-star today. We're just going for the victory. Victory is all I care about, and we're going to get it. There we go. On to the second side. Boom, 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 boom. Here we go again. This side should be a lot easier. That being said, we have actually no healer on this side, so that will be difficult. And I actually have to keep the pylon alive, too, because uh, it is at 34%. So we do actually have a chance to fail, which I won't do. Oh, God. Oh, God. I shouldn't speak so soon. Yamiko yeah, already lost like half her HP and this freaking crystal is still dying. How? Oh my goodness. These guys do damage. Okay. We froze them. I burst. There we go. These guys should die now. Get out of that and boom. Get them, Hazo. I gonna be honest. I don't know how to play Hazo. I haven't played them in forever, but there we go. That one's dead. Now it's just big guy remaining. We're going to try to save these bursts for the next half if I can. That being said, when the big man isn't frozen, it's kind of hard. All right. There we go. Two more hits and we're done. Whew, first part completed. Let's keep moving. I forget we also have Toma Shield. Let's go, Toma Shield. Huge, man. Let the magic begin. Let the magic begin. Time, to shine. Time to shine. Boom. Okay, I need you guys to attack him. Yes. Keep attacking. Just let the little guys attack and I'll just run around. Okay, now just keep attacking him. Break his shield, little guys. I'll just stay over here. Oh, never mind. They're gone. Okay, come back. Now just keep breaking the shield. Oh, good job, little guys. You made me proud today. And then all we need to do is let these little guys burst him to death. And eventually he will disappear. <laughs> this is so dumb. But you know it works. Go. You got it. Nice. <laughs> oh, I can't believe my strategy worked. Okay, let's keep going. We got one more side. Here we go. Aika burst off the rip. Big Yaimiko burst. Do your thing, Yaimiko. There we go. Okay, we killed one of them. Uh, these guys do so much damage, though. And they're gone. Uh, okay. Oh, there we go. He's back. Oh, hello there. And he's on the ground. Just freeze him real quick. And he's dead. Nice. Just this guy left. I think we can freeze him, too. And big Mona burst. He's frozen. Nice. Okay, good. He's down. Nice. We got him down after killing the crocodile thing. Boom. Oh, good job, Hazel. Let's go. Hazel always has the biggest hits. And we somehow managed to three-star that. We'll take it. Not too shabby. One last floor. Here we go. And it's two bosses? Oh, that's not good. I don't like bosses. Luckily, Lisa will carry us to victory. I have faith. Never mind. They poison us? Are you kidding me? I didn't know they did that. Okay, I need to heal. I need to heal. Big Lisa. She missed it. God, I hate that move. It's so useless. Okay, phase out of that. Nice. Ow. Okay, more healing, please. And just wait while we heal. Just, just give me a second. I'm just healing. Nice. And Lisa, don't die. Lisa didn't die somehow. I don't know how she didn't, but I am not complaining. Boom. Three little octopuses. Come help me. Clutch up for me. Ow. Distract them, Lynette. Yes, Lynette's distracting them. You got this, guys. Come on. Lynette with a huge distraction. Now all we got to do is kill this one. Easy peasy. One little guy remaining. Get him. Oh, Lisa's dead. It's fine. We just need to finish off this one. Yes, we did it. Good job, guys. Let's go. One more side remaining. We got this. Here we go. Only two opponents. Oh, say less. Easy peasy. I'm not even worried. I probably should be, though. Because these elemental reactions just are not working for me today. Okay, this one's frozen. Plus, we got Aika burst on him. There we go. Hazel got that kick in him, though. I'm not going to lie. Look at that move. Oh, my goodness. He is so powerful. Can I get his E back, please? Give me his, give me his E. Boom. 30K. Come on, Hazo. Hazo's too good. He's underestimated, honestly. And one more little E there. And just a couple more hits. One more hit and we're done. 
Yes, we beat it. Floor 11. Random Spiral Abyss done. One more floor to go. And that's the cue to head back to our randomizer and randomize two more teams for floor 12. All right, here we go. Two more teams. All right, so we got two teams. First half, we have Nouvellet, Kujo Sara, Kirara, and Fischl, which is pretty decent. Not sure how good my Kujo Sara is, but hopefully that side can hold up. Second half, we got Arataki Ito. That's great. Albedo, Ayaka, Bennett. Interesting sides. We're going to have to replace one of these units with Farina, and we'll have to decide which one it is. All right, so these are our two teams. If we look at the monster list here, you'll see that we have a pretty hard time against the second half. And seeing as there is an algorithm of, I'm not reading all that, on the second half, I think for time's sake, we're going to switch these two teams around and put this first half team here on the second half, just because this thing is basically impossible to defeat without Electro on your side and Fischl and Kujo Sara would work really well against that. So we're going to swap these two teams around. For the first half, we're going to have Bennett, Ayaka, and some others, uh, but we do have to fight here a Phil Philaminous Flames Lecter, which we don't have any Hydro for. So I'm thinking we either replace Albedo or Arataki Ito. I'm thinking probably Arataki Ito because I don't see him being much help in this first half. So we're going to take him out and then we're going to put Farina in. Next up, let's decide how we're going to build them. So most of these characters are already built. Of course, we've shown off the Farina kit. The Ayaka kit is the same as it's always been with Amanama Kaguchi and a four-piece Blizzard Strayer. Albedo is on a Sidonbar Spindle and a four-piece Husk of Opulent Dreams and eight, seven talents. Lastly here, Bennett is going to be on an Aquila Favonia. I know, surprise, surprise. We can even take a level 91 for him, which I have. Artifacts are the four-piece Noblesse. Surprise, surprise. Constellation 5, because I'm not a geek. And talents are 711. For the first half, we have my favorite character in the game, Nouvellet, who I'm very grateful I was able to get. We got him on Tome of the Eternal Flow on a three-piece March I'll Say Hunter, which we will change. Let's get his fourth piece back for him there. Constellation 0 and talents are 10, 10, 10, because I'm a Nouvellet simp. Fischl is next. She is level 90. Weapon is Polar Star. Artifacts are the four-piece Golden Troop. Constellation 6 and talents are 3, 13, 11. Karara is next. She is on a dull blade um that's not right let's get your favonia sword back and four piece no oblige as well and constellation zero because i can't get constellations for the life of me which really upsets me the last character we have is kujo sara she is on a fading twilight a four piece emblem constellation three and seven eight talents and just like that that's all our characters let's go on take on the challenge and see if we can beat floor 12 with random teams here we go boom boom get that farina burst up and now we go in albedo really weird addition to this comp but i'm not complaining albedo's a cool character i've actually liked albedo for a long time and i'm always happy to use him so let's see if he can make any use today boom put down the bennett burst farina burst and albedo burst usually albedo burst is a waste of time but in this situation in particular it's actually pretty helpful why are all my characters at half hp oh that's right the wolves and farina everything takes hp away from us i always forget that okay a couple more hits and you're almost dead okay you're dead now nice boom get farina burst up get albedo burst up here we go oh gosh he does damage he does a lot of damage just stay in the bennett burst just stay in bennett burst oh man bro i'm gonna need a lot of healing for this half these guys do a ton of damage. Ah, uh -huh. there we go. Kill this guy. Please kill this guy. I beg of you. Gosh, darn it, man. This guy won't die. Farina, get him, please. Boom. Come on. Get this man or thing or worm. I don't know what that is. Worm was definitely not the answer, though. And then you know what we do next? The same thing we did before. Just let Farina finish off the boss. Just walk around is basically the solution. Just put him back up, and look at that, he's almost dead. Perfect. Now it's just the second side remaining, which we have no healers on, so this will be a little bit more tricky, but I think we can make it work. Also, I have Nouvellet, which is probably a little broken for this challenge, because Nouvellet is way too good on his own, and honestly makes the entire game unfair. But, I'm not complaining. I'll take my luck, and I'll move on. Hold up, hold up his thingy. Boom! Get him! Nice. 
Oh, I just got an achievement. Oh, nice. I'll take an achievement. Thank you, game. Don't know what for, but hey, I'm not complaining. Now just kill this thingy. Quickly and assuredly. Nouvellet, please. God, this character is way too good. He is way too good. I should have just banned him from this challenge because he can basically do everything on his own. Like, I don't even need support characters. I could probably just use Nouvellet and this guy would be dead within minutes. And we have Fischl too. Let's go. Boom. One more Nouvellet burst. Or hit. Damn. Okay, your burst. Almost. Nouvellet, finish it off. So close. And we got it. Okay, first part completed. I should really be able to get three stars considering we got Nouvellet. Can't win them all. Here we go. Second half. Let's see how hard this one is. Hopefully not too bad because the last one had me crying. I cut out all the times of me dying, but trust me, there was a lot. Okay, get him. Those two are dead. And I almost got stuck on the elevator. Man, I hate that elevator. Get the rolly guy. Oh, and elevator. Man, why is the elevator a thing? Okay, he's dead. Nice. Just two of them remaining. Or actually, there's a lot more than two. But two right now. Sucker swirl. Witness. Great undertaking. And we almost got one of them here. Oh, shoot. Okay, no, wait. He's dead. Nice. A little bit more. Tiny bit more. There we go. Nice. Big Ica burst here. Here we go. Get that Albedo burst down. Come on. I love these little bubble guys. They're actually so OP. They let freeze last for a long time. Bubble guys plus freeze comp is kind of overpowered. Now all we have to do, finish this guy off and we're done. Oh god. No, not that move. Oh god. Uh, yeah, let's just run away from that. And get him with Aika. And we win. Almost. We need to just do the other side first. Um, a little, pres a little presumptuous there. Let's do this quickly. I mean, we literally have Nouvellet, so, uh... Yeah, Spiral Abyss may be a little bit uh, cracked this time. A little bit broke, if you will. Okay, now we go in. He's down on the ground, flopping like a fish. And now we just stand here and kill him. How long does he stand down for? Jeez, bro, he is weak in the knees. Okay, he stands down for a long time. My goodness, we almost killed him in that time it took him to get up. So long, we may actually beat him within seven minutes. Or maybe not. It's going to be close. Uh, Come on. Oh my goodness. Wait, did we do it? I can't tell. Oh my goodness. That was seven minutes on the dot. Jeez, I can't believe we did that. First three star on a floor 12 in a randomized spiral abyss. I think I've ever got. That is insane. I don't think I've ever had that happen in a randomized spiral abyss before on floor 12. Because usually we get terrible teams, but this time we actually had some decent ones. Okay, we need to kill these guys at the same time. I don't think we're probably going to get three stars again, but we're going to try to. We're going to try to. Oh god, Aika's going to die. Do this. Do this. Boom. 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 Don't die, Aika. Oh no, he's going to get it. Uh, he healed. Shoot. Don't die. Don't die. Oh gosh. Aika burst. Can this guy just die? Please. Burst. Okay, good. He's dead. Nice. Let my name echo once. Ah, that was close. Just kill this guy real quick. A couple Ayaka hits, a couple little octopus, some crab, and he's dead just like that. And now we have two abyss. Oh my god, why? Uh, I mean, we should be able to kill them until they're shield, but then once they get down to shield, I'm kind of just, uh, yeah, a little bit screwed to say the least. Shield is so hard to get past, man. Luckily, we got things like the Aika Burst to help us out, however. I don't think Geo can do anything to these guys, as far as I know. So it's literally just going to be waiting for Farina's little guys to finish it off again. <laughs> this seems to be quite a reoccurring thing where we just let the seashells, the crabs and whatnot, just do all our dirty work for us. Come on! And we got him. There we go. One final side remaining. And then we will have beaten the Spiral Abyss Randomizer Challenge. And it looks like it's just the Ice Dancers. Oh, this will be easy. I've defeated these guys so many times already. Easy peasy. Okay, maybe not. I should not be too cocky. Let's not get cocky and then I have to redo that whole thing again. That would be uh, real unfortunate. Luckily, we got the Car Carrara Shield. Or, or no, we don't. Not anymore. We did have it. Don't let Nouvellet die. Don't let Nouvellet die. Oh my goodness. Nouvellet dying would be worst case scenario. Unfortunately, they keep shredding the Karara shield whenever we get it, man. The minute I get it up, it's gone. Okay, there we go. We have it up again. There we go. There we go. And we get the Nouvellet heal. Perfect. These guys actually do a lot of damage. My goodness. 
Boom, 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 boom. Get him, get him, get him. Oh gosh, that's gonna hurt. No, okay, we're good. We're good. One more hit. Come on, so close. And we did it. Floor 12, random spiral abyss has been beaten. Always a fun little challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed today's random spiral abyss. Farina edition. I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did too. Hopefully Farina can come back for more videos when we decide to max out her kit. But for today, that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.